All right, I think we are live, folks. I believe. We'll see. I'm uh, <laughs> I'm still adjusting the camera apparently when I first started this stream. So, all right, guys. So, uh, what's going on? So, I apologize. We are late. We're about 16 minutes late starting this stream, and the reason for that is I am trying to stream. Let me adjust the camera a little bit here. I'm trying to stream apps that I play on my phone or my tablet all the time that are great like on tour and I thought okay I'm going to do that it's not on steam yet at least I don't think it's on steam um, and so because it's not on steam I'm like I can't stream it from steam I'll just go ahead and stream it right from uh, an emulator I have an emulator app that uh, lets me stream games and I'm, or lets me play games on my on my computer and so I'm like all right and I've done this many a times I played patchwork on here I've done lots lots of emulators and things and but unfortunately and I'll show you this right now if you guys want to uh, see some technical behind the scenes BS that's going on. Uh, this is the emulator Mimu that I, I use. I've used it for many years. It's great. It lets me play apps. And I've got on tour in here. When I click on it, it says on tour has stopped. So that sucks. So uh, for some reason, it does not like the emulator. I don't know why. So we're going to close that up, get rid of that, close up all this stuff here. And we are going to do this a little differently tonight. So I have my tablet here. We're going to see how well this turns out. I may delete this video afterwards. I don't know. I have my tablet here. And I am going to basically stream to you guys live just from the camera. I'm going to put the tablet on the table here. Point the face camera at it. So you're not going to see my face. You're going to see just the tablet, which is fine. And you don't need to see my face anyway. And we're going to play on tour right here on the tablet. I've already got it brought up on the screen here. So let's uh, let's put this down on the table here, and I'm going to point the camera directly at it. I think it'll pick it up and it'll be fine. I might have to turn the lights off in the room here, which is fine. But I think we are going to have a, you know, I think I think it'll work well. So let's find out. Let me go ahead and turn the brightness up on this a little bit. I think that will help a lot if you have the brightness up a little bit. So let's get this just a little bit brighter here. Dis display brightness. There we go. That way it'll show up for you guys a little better. There we go. And now let's get started. Let's see how this works. I'm going to turn the camera. And we're going to point it right here at the tablet. Let me get this a little better so it's right in line so you guys can see it. This is what you call ghetto streaming. All right. This is... Uh, this is streaming when you have technical difficulties. So that's we're gonna let's see if we can get this centered here, make it look a little better. So we look we're gonna look, we're gonna try to look professional, okay? We're gonna try to look really professional, okay? Yeah, this is this is professional. There we go. There you go. That's that's as good as it's gonna get, I think. Let's see. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> okay. It's so funny because like when I see on the screen is opposite of what I'm looking at when I slide it around. All right, there we go. That's as good as it's going to get. All right, folks, so we're going to play on tour on the uh, on the DAP here. So before we get started, oh, thank you, Jessica. Oh, yes, it's very bad luck. Uh, thanks for watching. I, I appreciate you coming in and checking us out. So uh, we are going to play on tour. Now, I have played this many, many times on the app. I love it. I played it on the, on the board game also. I've also backed the new reprint. Jessica, I see you backed too. That's cool. It's awesome. Looks like it's going to be a blast. I love this. This is a great roll and write game. This other game they have over here, too. This is a QE. This is their other game. That's a great game, too. So we are going to play on tour here. And let me zoom in just a little bit more so I can get it a little closer to make it easier for you to see. I want it to focus. All right. That's good enough. There we go. All right. So let's get started here. We're going to hit play. Uh, we don't need the tutorial because I'm going to teach you guys how to play as we do this. So it's going to pull up four cards right off the bat here. And it's still a little bit out of focus. This is how to tick off Mike Day. That's what it is. How to make Mike mad. That's that's what the, this day is. All right. Turn off the lights here so that you don't get a, a glare. Turn off this light. No glare at all there. There we go. I'll sit here in the dark and play games. That's not creepy at all. Oh, there we go. That looks pretty good. Wow. 
Okay, turned a little better than I thought. Okay, looks just like the app. You'd never know. You'd never know. All right. So there you go. So we're going to uh, pick a state. So basically, it gives us four numbers to start off with here. And so it's given us a, uh, a 94 here, a 20, and a 2, and a 49 here over on the other side. So it's given us a few numbers here so that we are uh, we have a, kind of a setup in one second. All right. So we've got numbers already uh, put on the on the board here. It comes up with these cards on the side here. So this uh, gave us an east, an east, and a north. And the cities that came up on that basically get preceded on the board here. So we've got the United States kind of preceded with four numbers. And the goal of the game is to get the numbers to link as much as possible across the board in order. So the only thing you need to know, this is my, my friend Charlie says this, do you know the numbers? Do you know what order they come in? then you're good. You can do this. You can play this game. So and that, so I know the numbers. I know what order they come in. And so we're going to try to play this game to to get our numbers to in order here. So what do we have here? We have, let's see, we got a two over here uh, in this state here. I think it's uh, New York. and or, no, or just south of New York there. And we've got uh, a 94 over here, a 20. We've got a 49 over here. So I'm, I want to try to get these linked in order as much as possible. Unfortunately, the two and the 94 are right next to each other. So I've got to either just abandon the two, forget about it, or I've got to try to link to that two and go around this way and come back to the 94. And the 49 is way over here and the 20 is right here. And the 20 and the 94 are right next to each other. So I'm probably just gonna to have to abandon one of those two numbers. I'm gonna to have to say, okay, I'm not gonna link that. So what I'm probably gonna do is start with a two, get as many numbers as I can between two and 20 linked together and then link a bunch of numbers over here to get to 49, and then my higher numbers will probably be over here on the, on the west coast here. I don't know if that's going to work or not. We'll see. But what I've got to do is I've got to put a 34 and a 43 on the board right now. That's my, my numbers I have to place on the board at this time. So uh, can I fit those numbers somewhere on here that's going to make sense? And let's see. I think... Hmm... So I could put a 43 over here near the 49. That's actually probably a good idea. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go over here next to, right here in New England. Oh no, I'm sorry, no, no, not New England. Um, and Nebraska, and I'm gonna put 43 there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna name the states wrong the whole time, just to let you know, right? And a 34, if you put the number in one of these ones that has a circle on it, which means it matches the city, you get extra points. I'm gonna put a 34 here. Probably not going to get the link to it, but we'll see. All right, there you go. Those are numbers. We'll go to the next set of numbers. It rolls the dice again, and we have a 19 and a 91. Again, I'm just going to abandon the 94 there. I don't think I'm going to get to that. So let's go ahead and... Ooh, 19 would be... Oof. So I can go from 2, jump right to 19, but I don't want to do that. I need to put the 19 next to the 20. So I'm going to put the 19 right here in North Carolina. That's touching the 20 now. That's good. This is still fuzzy on the screen. I want this to be focused on so you guys can see this. I don't know why it's so uh, out of focus. Hmm. I was hoping it would be in focus for you guys, but it is not in focus. I'm about to abandon the stream and just delete it. Irritating the poop out of me that's better but now it's small <clears throat> there we go super close now we can get now we can see it okay ah oh, what the <laughs> it's like oh look I'm in I'm in focus and then as soon as I let it go it goes out of focus you know what, guys I apologize we're going to have to stop the stream. This is just, I don't know what happened. Uh, that's a good question, Jessica. Can I lock the focus? Let's see. Let's see if I can lock the focus. Because that is just blurry as poop right now. I don't want it to do that. I want it to focus on the map. You think it would pick up the numbers down here and like focus on the numbers.
I can control the focus. Look at that. There we go. Nice tip, Jessica. Yep. I turned the autofocus off, and now we're good. All right. Thank you very much. And let's close the focus up. There we go. All right, we're good. All right, back to playing on tour. Thank you, Jessica. That was awesome. All right, good enough. Here we go. All right, so I've got some numbers here. I've got a 19. I got a 91. The 19 I placed right next to the 20. That's good. And next we have, let's see, um, why is that still on the screen there? I don't need to see that. I can get rid of that. There we go. Um, all right, so I can uh, see. Next thing I want to do here is I want to place the 91. I could try to place the 91 next to the 94. There's a chance that I might get across the board and back around to that 91. So, sure, I'll go ahead and place it right here. Totally don't think that's going to happen, but we'll place it there. All right, next, what do we have here? We've got central, south, south, and we've got a 9 and a 90 here. So, let's see. A 9 and a 90. Mm, okay. Okay. So this is where you come into a dilemma. I've got a 2, and I've got a couple of spaces between here and 20 there. So if I put a 9 here, that's a pretty good spot to put one. But now I, if I want to put something in the uh, in, uh, MC here, I've got to have a uh, I've got to have a number between 2 and 9. That's much harder to get here. What do I have of 90? So that's I could put that right next to my 91 here. And again, I'm a, I might actually make some kind of path to come back. We'll see. Let's see what happens. Moving on. Oh, so we got a star. I can place a... That means when you roll doubles, basically. If you roll two dice that match, you get a star. Now I can place a star anywhere on... Oh, no, actually, I'm sorry. It wasn't the dice. It was the cards over here. If you get three cards that match, I got a north, north, and north, then you can put a, a number, basically, as a star, which is a wild, anywhere you want. So I am going to place a star between my two and my nine here. Because that's a small margin there. I want to make sure I can make that connection. So I'm going to place a, a star right there, I believe. Let's see. Is that the best place for it? Hmm. Yep. I think that's the best place for it. So I'm going to place it right there. Star. Boom. Good to go. Now I, I have for sure have connected my 2 and my 9 there. Um, all right. And now what do we have here? We've got 56 and 65. And south, south, and west. 56 could go over here in Washington. Yeah, so I've got to hope to get a number between 49 and 56 to connect those. And let's see, 65. That, I do, oof. Okay, so let's do this. Let's put the 56 over here. Or should I put the 65 up there? Let's see. So I want to come back around, maybe, and connect this way. So the lower numbers will probably go around the bottom, and the higher numbers may cross the top. So maybe this should be the 65 then. So let's undo that. Let's make that a 65. Yep, there we go. And let's put the 56 down here, close to the 49. Oh, yeah, let's put it right here, right next to it. There we go. Next. All right, now I have an 89 and a 98. Again, getting these numbers that are in the 90s here. Well, I can again, I can come back across here. So there's 90, 91. If I put the 98 here, that's going to give me a circle too, which gives me a bonus. So let's put it in the 98. And then an 89 right next to it here, right next to the 90. I got a good little string going there, but again, didn't plan on doing that in this game. But, oh, and now I have a star. That's good. Hmm. Between 65, 56, 49, they have... All three of them are connected to uh, Idaho here. I want to go ahead and put a star there just because I'm not sure how those are going to connect. If I get a bunch of 50 numbers or a bunch of 40 numbers, it could screw me up over here. So I'm going to put a star right here between those. That should give me a, a good spot. All right, so let's go to the next one here. All right, and now I've got a 48 and an 84. 48... That would go between the 43 and the 49. So I can put that right here in South Dakota. 48. There we go. 
and then 84 there's my 89 all right so here's what I'm, I'm gonna deliver now if I start at my 2 go to 9 19 20 34 I really need like two or three numbers here to get to 43 and I've already, actually I've already cut myself off uh, yep not gonna get to that 43 I'm gonna have to go around this way go to 46 49 maybe 65 to get back around um, yeah I've kind of cut myself off yeah I, hosed, I got hosed um, all right so what can I do here with that 84 not much of anything I can put it right next to the 89 maybe yeah let's do that let's put it right next to the 89 there we go. I drew a line in from it. You don't have to keep those lines. Those are just, if you want to, you, you can draw lines to help yourself. If you're like, I think I want to go here maybe later on to help you remember what kind of path you're trying to make. But I don't do that typically because it takes too long. All right, 39 and 93. 39 would go perfectly right after the 34 here. So let's put it here. And then 93. I can put that right between the 91 and the 94. That's that worked out great. Oh wait, wait, no, no, wait, wait. Okay, yeah. So if I put the the 93 here, then I'll go 90, 91, 93, 94. It would be really hard for me to get back to that 98. I would need there's only four numbers between 94 and 98 there. It would be very difficult for me to get back to that. So if I put that 93 in there, I'm really cutting myself off from getting to that number. But if I go to 94 and I stop there, then I really don't, it really doesn't matter anyway. So, yep, let's do it. Let's go ahead and put 93 in there. All right, moving on. Going to the next. And we got a 24 and a 42. All right, 24 would come right after the 20, which is great. I could put it right here. That connects my 34 and 24 there and 20. And now I've got a 42. Don't really have a good spot for that. Let's see. 43. The 43 is already surrounded by a bunch of the numbers, so the 42 does not do me any good there. I'm going to put it. And my 84 is there. kind of cut me off. So, yeah. I wish I could put a 42 here in Oklahoma. That'd be great because I'd connect to my 39. But I don't have a spot for it. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that 42 since it's kind of in a bad spot. I'm going to put it way up here in the corner just to get rid of it. Put it up here in New England. Goodbye. So this is one of the techniques in the game I use is just like you save your New England and Florida. This is a spot just throw numbers in to get them out of the way because uh, it's very hard to make a connection through all 50 states. Oh, I got a 19 and a 91 again. That's actually not a bad thing because if you put a 19 next to a 19, it's, it still works as a connection. And you put a 91 next to a 91, it works as a connection. Unfortunately... My 19 is already surrounded, and I can't put it in South Carolina because it's I didn't get a card for that this turn. And 91 is completely surrounded except for Oklahoma here. So, yeah, let's go there. Let's go to Oklahoma with 91. And let's take the 19 and stick it down here in Florida. Oh, no, I can't. Florida's not lit up this time. So we're going to go up here to New York. Stick it up there. There we go. All right, now i got a 57 and a 75. And... 57 works great right next to the 56, but I don't think I'm even going to get over to those numbers. So let's see what's going to happen. I'm going to go 2, 19, 9, 20, 34, 24, 34, 39. I need to get from 39 to 84. I need to get a number between 39 and 84 in that spot right there. 57 would do that for me, so let's go ahead and put the 57 there. Three. Oh, you know what? 75 would probably be better. Yeah. Okay, let's undo that. And what I can do is I can put... I've only got one south number, though. I don't I understand we're in the north. Mm, that doesn't do me any good. And I, I can't guarantee I'm going to get a number that goes between there again. So let's go ahead and do that. Forget it. We're going 57 right there. That'll connect my 84 to my 39. And now I have a 75 left. 75. Yeah, sure. Let's put it over here, just in case. Uh, it's not going to work. not going to do anything. But I, I'm going to get a horrible, horrible score this time. But that's okay, though. Everything's going wrong today. Why not? Yep. Yeah, the lines help a lot sometimes, Jessica. You can put lines right between these like that just to kind of like remind yourself, okay, I'm going this way, I'm going that way. Um, I know I'm going from my 2 to my 
uh, to my star over here, and then from there to my 9, and then from there to my 19, and then from there to my 20, and from there to my 24. So I can kind of show what I'm trying to do here. But the nice thing about this app is once you're done, it figures out your best app or your best route for you and tells you what your score is. I love that part. Okay, uh, continue on. We have 14. Uh, two, four, nine. I could put the 14 over here, but it's not going to connect though, because there's no way to get from the. I've got a 9 and 19. If I could stick the 14 between the 9 and 19, that'd be great, but they're already connected. So the 14 really does me no good at all. What about the 41? I get my 43 surround over here. That does me no good. Yeah. I'm... I got hosed, Tommy. I got hosed. So why not? Let's stick the 41 over here. Maybe it connects some kind of weird way. I, don't... I can't see. Let's put the 14 down here because that's useless. Moving on. And then we got 17 and 71. So 71 can go over here. Somewhere. Sure. Let's put it over here. 17. Again, not doing any good. It goes between the 9 and the 19. So you just you don't know what numbers you're going to get. So let's put the 17 down here. Next. And I got a 9 and a 90. Uh, oh, the 9 would be great right next to the 9, but unfortunately it can't get back to the 19 if I connect it there. There's no line connecting between there, so that doesn't do me much good. Um, 90, I can't put that next to the 90 I already have because it's completely surrounded. So again, I got hosed. So yeah, why not? Let's go ahead and put the 9 over here, and we'll put the 90... And yeah, we'll stick it over here in this corner, out in the middle of nowhere. Doesn't really do us any good anyway. Almost done. 67 and 76. Don't They don't fit over here at all, so I want to put them both over here. Let's go with uh, 67 right next to the... Yeah, 65, and then do 76 right here next to this. Because we get a circle for that one, so let's put it there. Again, I don't think these none of these are going to be used. I'm going to get a horrible score this time. Uh, let's see. 76, 87. Again, numbers that I really can't use. I'll put the 76 over here. Or 70, I'm sorry, 78, 87. Does me no good anywhere. Let's just stick it up here. Man, it's going to be a bad score. Oh, 46, 64. Again, numbers that just don't help me at all. That's, oh, 46 actually does help me right here. 46 will connect that 34 to the 57, or the 39 to it, actually. So that's good. 64. I've got to stick it over here. None of these help, so we're going to stick it right here. I think it's the last set of numbers here. 39, 93. Oh, I can put a 93 right next to a 93. That's good. So let's do that. Let's put a 93 right next to a 93. And then 39... You can just stick that over here. And then last one. Oh, I can put a 96 right here. That actually might give me one extra score. 96, there we go. Last turn. Hit the button there. It says calculating. Now this is going to give me my score, which is nice. I don't have to actually do this myself. It kind of comes up and shows me. Boom, 25. That was better than I thought I was going to do. So you can see it started up here. I actually started with my star, so I basically counted that as a 1. 2, 9, uh, another 9, 19, 20, 24, 34, 39, 46, 57, 84, 89, 90, 91, 91, 93, 93, 94, 96. So my plan of going around the board and coming back just didn't quite work out. I got a little shorter path there than I wanted to, but that's how the game works. All right, so let's go up top, and I'll tell you my thoughts on the game. Yeah, right in my face. That's what you want to see. Close up a mic. That's what you want to see. All right, guys. So there you go. So that is the game uh, on tour on the app, playing on my tablet here. <laughs> this is what you call ghetto streaming. So um, sorry about the technical difficulties. I don't know why my emulator is not playing these apps, but that's on tour. I love the game. It's a great game. I think my highest score right now is probably like 36-ish, something like that. So 25 is nowhere near my highest score, but I love the game. It is a quick roll and write. This is one of those games, like, if I pull out my, my tablet, actually, I, don't, I usually play it on my phone. It works great on the phone. 
if I'm playing on my phone and like you say you're waiting at the doctor's office or wherever, it's great to pull out your phone and just play a quick game of it. It doesn't take but you know ten minutes as you can see, and it's a lot of fun. And if you don't do well, oh well, restart next game and try it again and uh, just try to get try to beat your score from before. Um, it's a lot of figuring out, okay, there's 20 numbers between this place and this place, and there's only 10 numbers between these two places, so let me leave that open because that's a better spot for me. I can, I'll, probably get, I'll probably roll a number that'll fit there. Probably, but not always. And then you get numbers, like you may roll the same number three times. Like I, like I did here, I rolled a 90, what was it, 91, something like that? I rolled 91 uh, like three times. Yeah, 91, 91, a 90, and a 93, and a 93, yeah. So I rolled a bunch of numbers that were, that were the matching. I totally didn't know that was going to happen, but I just happened to get lucky and have a spot to place that. So that kind of worked out. So well, there you go, guys. That's on tour. They just finished up a Kickstarter, the second edition. If Maybe you can go in and do a late, late pledge on it. Check it out. I love this game. Their other game, QE, is a lot of fun, too. Uh, BoardGameTables.com, you guys done a great job. I uh, apologize for the technical difficulties on this video. I'm going to make sure the next one does not have these issues. So there you go. I uh, hope you guys are enjoying the streaming episodes of On uh, No Table Required. Uh, and uh, we'll, we'll, be, we'll be on next week, every Wednesday at 6 Eastern Time, streaming some kind of game for you. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, go check out our, our uh, YouTube uh, channel, all other pages. Like and subscribe, of course. Uh, we're on Instagram, and we put pictures of uh, board games on there all the time. We're on Twitter, talking to people. And our podcast, we just had uh, some board game designers and publishers on there and interviews. Go check that out. Our podcast is great. We have a lot of fun doing that. So thanks for watching, guys. You guys have a great evening. I'll talk to you next week. Bye-bye.